Hey, what's going on, guys? Sitting in front of the sit uh, 66. Got the engine out. Uh, I'll be tearing that apart, but I just wanted to let you guys know that um, the reason why I haven't been doing uh, any videos, I have been making videos, um, but I haven't been editing them. I've just been recording them, putting them on my hard drive, and kind of not not like really saving them for later because actually uh, FedEx delivering me some some bolts for my engine stand made in the USA how about that but anyway um I'll be editing those. Uh, what I really want to do is, what I really want to let you know is, is um, I created a second channel, um, and all of the videos that I will be doing on cars and vehicles and things like that, <clears throat> they are going to be on that channel. The channel's name is Galaxy Garage. I'll put the link in the description. Uh, please go over there and subscribe. Uh, I'd really appreciate it. Uh, so basically what, what I'm doing is this channel is basically going to be for like my gardening videos, uh, any other random topics or anything like that. And Galaxy Garage is going to be Galaxy Garage. It's going to be more geared towards the garage and things like that. So um, I'll be doing another video on this channel. Um, because I got a little bit of surprise, so I did trade the MGB for a vehicle, actually three. Um, <clears throat> so that will be over there. I will put that video. Um, I'll put that video on this channel, The Awakening, when I have Galaxy Garage already set. Now I have Galaxy Garage already set. It's already set up. It's there. Uh, I redid some videos for from the 67, so I re-edited a lot of the videos from the 67 because I wanted to start off with the 67. So if you want to go over to Galaxy Garage and watch the edited versions of some of the videos that I put on this one for the 67, please feel free to go do so. Uh, like I said, I edited them, so th I, I think they're a lot better than the ones that were not edited because I didn't have an editing program. And one of the reasons why I really haven't been putting out videos is you all know that uh, our dog Ozzy <clears throat> is in stage four of kidney failure. And I just want to, what I really wanted to do, I mean, like I said, I'm making like very short videos, so I'm not staying out in the garage very long. I'm just kind of doing, you know, random things for about an hour or two hours, and then I'm stopping uh, because I really want to spend a lot of time with him. I want to make sure that he gets, you know, a lot of time with us, and I really do think that his time is getting very short now. Uh, the last vet checkup, not this one that we just did, but the last vet checkup, his numbers were were staying the same. He's not. He wasn't losing any weight or anything like that. So, and they said that he's he, he's a hell of a dog. He's he's a trooper. Uh, they said that he's basically lived longer than any dog really should in stage four uh, kidney failure. So, I'm actually glad that I've got a, a lot of time with him. That we did get a lot of time with him. But like I said, you know this. Probably for the past six to eight months, it, it's been hard watching him go from such a hyperactive, loving dog to, you know, now he's making accidents on the floor and he's not peeing and pooping on himself yet. We're kind of thinking that when that time comes, then, you know, that, that'll be, you know, that'll be it. Uh... And I have been, we have really been concentrating on ourselves as well. Uh, I hope 
looking at this video, I hope you can tell that I've lost weight, I, which I have. Uh, I was 270 pounds in November, and then I decided to do somewhat of a, and I'll put this on the channel too as well, a lot of, you know, my, what I did uh, since November. So November, you know, I just decided, you know, I'm, I'm on blood pressure medication, I'm on high cholesterol medication, I got Lealda because of my UC, I've got Omeprazole because of my acid reflux and those are not really good combinations especially coming from a certain country of origin that gave us something a couple years ago and if you've been keeping up it does tend to take out the obese and ones that have comorbidities so best way to combat that is to start eating better and start getting your ass in gear and start getting your ass healthy so november i decided it's it, it's really time so i've been doing that i am now 213 pounds so i've lost what about 57 pounds and my weight keeps dropping off and i'm i love it um i'll be talking about what i did how i did it uh, everything that I did, including all of the garbage and shit like that that I've eaten, including that, because I think when people put their weight loss programs and stuff like that, you kind of think that they just eat to the T, everything healthy. That That's not me. That's not me. I'm not going to tell you, hey, I didn't do this because, hey, guess what? I like candy. You think since November? It, it is right now, April. It's almost the end of April. We're getting into May. Do you think I didn't have any candy within that time? If you think that I didn't have any candy in that time, you're nuts. Because I did. Now, I did buy some sugar-free candy. And you eat a couple of those and you're sitting on the toilet for a little while. So. so, eh. But... Did I ha have I had gorges of candy like I did before when I was about 270? The answer is no. That is a definite no. Uh, I have seriously cut back on a lot of it. I mean, I'm not going to tell you I went straight up to zero, but I've kind of left the candy behind. Um, when I was 270, I was basically drinking a Red Bull a day. Some people would say, well, yeah, that's not too bad. When you start looking at the carbohydrates and the added sugar in it and stuff like that, yeah, we'll just say that a Red Bull is a, let's see, ever since November I finished up, I had six cans of Red Bull left before I stopped. I think I eventually finished those. I think I still have one Red Bull that I bought like three or four weeks ago because I was at the store and I was like, screw it, I just want to buy a Red Bull. I bought it, never drank it. It's in the refrigerator right now, just sitting there. Yeah, I guess one day I'll actually drink it, but, you know. But, you know, I'll be going through that on, on this channel and stuff like that. I hope you enjoy that. Remember, I'm not a dietitian. I'm just telling you what I did. That, that's it. I'm just telling you what I did, what I'm doing, and the weight's coming off. So... I hope you guys subscribe over to Galaxy Garage. There's going to be a lot of good content. Uh, now that I got the editing program, you're going to see a lot of good edits. You know, I'm very big into movies. If you can't tell with my edits and things like that, that I like to throw in some movie clips. So, uh, hopefully you guys look up some of the movies that I actually enjoy. Because there's quite a few movies that I enjoy that I don't think uh, a lot of people know about. So if you do watch my video and you watch my videos all the way through and you see a video clip and you're like, what the hell movie was that? Yeah, go ahead and let me know and, you know, put a comment in there and let, let me know what clip it was and I'll let you know what movie it is. So, so the next video that'll be coming, I got a propagated, uh, a great pop propagating video pretty soon. Um, that I'm going to release after this one. 
because uh, I did get some more grape cuttings and I'm going to go over how I was able to get those to root. Uh, so, with all ado, I hope you guys over go subscribe to me over at Galaxy Garage. I would really, really appreciate it. Uh, I'm sorry you had to listen to this for about 11 minutes. It's kind of bad. Um, but like I said, go ahead and go subscribe over to me to Galaxy Garage if you're interested in the car videos. So, once I get... Um, once I get a certain video up on Galaxy Garage, that's when I'll put the video of us trading the MGB. Because I didn't really want to do, you know, clickbait because it would be, you know, what did I trade the MGB for on the Awakening channel? And then you would have to go to Galaxy Garage to actually see what I traded the MGB for. And if I don't have the video of what I traded the MGB for on Galaxy Garage, that would be kind of messed up, wouldn't it? I think it would. I'd be pretty disappointed, and I don't know if I'd unsub from you, but I'd probably let you know. <laughs> so, all right, guys, take it easy. Peace.